Greetings and welcome to the RC Wall of Vacuum Channel. For today's video, I'm up here on the top of my property, uh, overlooking uh, this ravine. And before you get your hopes up, I don't plan on jumping, at least not yet. But what I do have planned is a uh, new twist on uh, big bore, fist scale, RC gas uh, driving adventures. So for this adventure, I have up here the um, Taylor GT50 powered uh, Vecta 5. I got the spike wheels on it. And what we're going to be doing is going to try and some hill climbs. We'll take a look at the hill. So this is the hill here. I got it cleared off, raked out, and cleaned up. Uh, it's uh, it's you know the camera's not going to show the angle and size of it, but I can tell you it's about 120 foot down to the very bottom there. And on average, it's probably around 35 to 38 degrees. It does vary as, as you come up and up the hill. So I'll take a walk down with the camera and get a feel for what the hill's like. And uh, hope I don't slide. Oh, almost did. It's pretty steep. As you can see from these angles. A few months ago I did a video on uh, GoPro, 3D printing GoPro mounts, and this is what uh, they were meant for, is this kind of stuff right here. I got two set on, up on these trees. This is the last section I gotta go around. This is a little, it's a little muddy and slippery. As you can see, I don't have a whole lot of spot down here to start from. So I basically gotta start from a, a dead standstill and head on up that hill. And like I said, it's deceptive in the camera as to how steep it really is. Now if I conquer this one, there's plenty more to pick from over here. And some of them are just not doable. There is a section over here I could get cleared out and still got more hills. So I'm pretty much ready to go. I just got to get the vehicle down in here and fire it up and uh, give it a test run, see what happens. Well, there's where it ended up when I shut it off. I wasn't sure where it was where it was pointing. I couldn't see from down there, but at least it ended up it didn't roll back down the hill. Now that was cool as shit. I actually had a lot of fun coming up through there. I was a little nervous about it because I didn't know if I didn't make it where the vehicle was going to go, and I'm up here by myself. Unfortunately, my videographer is tied up today. Um, that was definitely the trial run. I'm going to get up here more this fall and do some more of this, and uh, I'm going to get a, get my videographer up to help it and. Uh, Get some, get some better video on, on, on the hill itself. And it'd be nice to have somebody here to catch this thing in case it goes awry. So it's definitely a lot funner than uh, going around on the track, but uh, I suppose this will get old too eventually, especially if you're uh, having a, a little mishap and it rolls 120 foot down into the ravine. But I guess that's part of the fun. So Kai over there, KGM 5512, and uh, Wade and Vance over at SRE Customs, uh, Next time you come out, I've got a new spot for you to test out your vehicles. I'm sure you'll like it. So in the meantime, uh, thanks for watching.